welcome. I'm sitting still now. You are sitting still. <laughs> but we can add to the list author now as well because you've just come out with an amazing, huge, very heavy book. It's quite heavy, yeah. <laughs> it is. It's full of amazing pictures yes. of you, of course, throughout yeah. your life, but also with lots of anecdotes. Yeah, a little aside, really. I didn't really want to do another written book. I feel like I've, I've said too much verbally, so let the pictures do the talking. You know, and a lot of these pictures are kind of not from the digital age. You know, they're kind of real, authentic old photos from the 70s and from the 80s. And I think, you know, photos, those old photos do have a kind of real special quality about them. We're just looking at some of them now. They are really quite special. And um, it's interesting to see how you've, how you've changed and how your look has changed over the years. Yeah, one of the funny things about looking back at pictures is you sort of look at it, oh, I look great there. And you remember <laughs> how insecure you were back yeah, then, you know, so. You remember. Those things. Um, only 999 copies have been printed. <laughs> you have to be a serious fan or seriously rich to buy one. They're £499, is that right? Yeah, but if you get them now, they're cheaper. How, how is it now? It's a, it's a mere... In the next few days, it's about 100 quid cheaper. Oh, but cheaper than Bart's Hospital. Cheaper than Bart's <laughs> Hospital. <laughs> it is cheaper than moving a hospital. Che cheaper than right. uh, Tracy Edmonds' bed. <laughs> cheaper than lots of things. <laughs> so you can get an advanced copy now. They're online, You can, and they're, they? they're cheaper, and, yeah. And, and it is a true fan that's going to buy this book, obviously. Well, you know, um, I bought one on David Bowie. So I suppose, yeah, I mean, if you love an artist, then, you know, it, it, it's really a collector's thing. You know, I would say don't, don't get into debt. <laughs> yeah, of course. Steal it. <laughs> no, stop it. Don't say that. My word. Now, um, this, you've been very busy, haven't you? Because you've also got a new single. Should we have a quick listen to yeah, it lovely. first? Yeah, it. Turn to dust. You said you're going to sit down, but you keep dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about this then, your new single. Well, the song, you know, it, it's funny actually because I was talking, you know, I've been doing a lot of press for this, and, you know, what I've discovered is that my kind of message hasn't changed in 30 years. I'm still singing about, you know, tolerance and, and prejudice, and the song really is, is, is about that, you know, and I, it's just ironic that, you know, 30 years on, you know, because next year's my 30th anniversary. Is it really? Well, that's the extraordinary thing about you is you do have such an enduring success. What secret do you have do you think that makes you so popular for such a long time well someone once said that if you you know if you stick around long enough <laughs> you know the, the term is mo down. like monuments and something else if you stick around long enough you you finally get respect or, or people just get used to i think yeah. you know well it's great to see you. thanks very much indeed for coming to the studio you've made me feel seriously underdressed I mean, you're so, you're so I, I need beautiful. a few more rhinestones <laughs> don't i really <laughs> boy george thanks for coming in Thank and, and best of luck with the single in the book Thank you.